Alright, we have a lot of stuff, not much, but a tad bit of stuff to cover today, so make sure to subscribe before we start. But firstly, we have the I Walk the Path of Glory that came out 8 hours ago, which was... Let's watch it first, just so you guys know what it is. It's the same portal looking thing, really cool cult, cool blocks Deathwalker, and a cool animation that transitions into the fire eyes on, of the Deathwalker skin right here. Yeah, many people thought this was uh, gonna be like a advantage, since this is 29,000 Robux I believe. Yeah, people thought it was gonna be like, gonna give people an advantage if they have this and thought it was gonna be pay to win. Also what made them think that is because of this tweet that Lucas sent out earlier, it's says it's like the transcript i don't even know devrel development group some strings yeah unlock gold track with core blocks purchase so obviously you could get like cool items gold track i'm not sure what that is but i'm pretty sure it might be these gold items so yeah that's what uh made people think that the core blocks death walker will give you like cool items like instead of these ordinary blue dark blue items but roblox has confirmed that this event will not be pay to win so i don't know why they post this they probably just wanted to show their cool animation that they made and it is cool not gonna lie so good job roblox on making this cool animation yeah they probably just wanted to promote it yeah the cool of death walker but cool that's covered thank you to lily for this tweet but there are as you can see many games a total of one two three four pages with a total 90 games that are basically confirmed all confirmed because some of them have maybe, which means they haven't been confirmed confirmed yet. So as you can see, there's big games like Adopt Me, Blocks Fruits, and what else can we find here that I know? Gunfight Arena, my gameplay footages, uh, Please Donate, and a controversial game, Toilet Tower Defense. Some people hate that it's gonna be part of the hunt, but some people like it because there are a lot of Toilet Tower Defense fans here. But yeah, that's basically it. Another game added to the hunt event, Total Roblox Drama. What is this? Mojo Games? What is that? Roblox Drama. Oh, Roblox Drama. Yeah, I guess that's cool. So, next from Bloxy News. So, the Hunt First Edition will be opening in March 15th. Now they have a time that is confirmed. How do we know this? You see, if we go to the Roblox's uh, homepage, official page, whatever, anyways, roblox.com, they have added a new tab. You see, there's normally only these stuff and get premium, that's it. But they added an events. And as you can see, really clearly, the Hunt First Edition. And what do we know here? A countdown. And this countdown should be this exact date and time, 10 a.m. Pacific time. So that's two days, 10 hours, 40 minutes, and 25 seconds recording this video with not much stuff, but are you ready? Which I guess makes sense. And as you can see here, all the items that were leaked by Lucas. Yep, right here, the blue items here, the wings the sword and the star glasses, my favorite item, the lava lamp. And yeah, just a really cool animation coming out of these. What is that? I think they're portals. Yeah, portals, portal, portal. They look like shipping containers to me. There's also a guitar and a headphone that's confirmed that hasn't been on Lucas's profile. Either I haven't seen the update, but yeah, that's updated. Coming back to this, this game. I'm not sure what it is, but if I'm reading the tweet correctly, it's by Roblox Presents, it's unavailable because the hunt's not out yet. But if I'm reading this correctly, this should be the game that has all the user progress information, the personal vault, I'll talk about that later. Uh, house portals, which should be portals, teleporting you different game, teleporting you to different games, participating experiences, and personal vault. The vault is full of specifically created curated rare and elusive items and badges are the key to unlocking them so i guess you do need badges to get some of the items all items will be available for a limited time obviously this was announced to be around two weeks long so i guess that's the deadline to getting the cool items here and more stuff so the hunt first edition uh, is supposedly the Roblox testing waters to see if it'll perform well in their platforms and yeah. I just thought I'd add this before I forget about it. Creecraft got banned, Roblox banned me for seven days for uh, all of this nonsense. I don't, I haven't watched this stream yet, but yeah, he got banned. So this is just like a message to not do stupid stuff on Roblox for the next couple of days. So you don't get banned and you don't miss out on the cool items. So yeah, that's sad, Creecraft. Hopefully it's a, like a false ban or something. I mean, I guess he could come back at the 19th, but that's a little late. A big content creator missing out on such an event is a lot of views just down the drain. Comment down below if you're really happy about any of these games. Maybe it's your favorite games being put into the hunt comment down below and like this video subscribe and goodbye